Hi, I'm just doing some tests on uh, my newly installed Path Pilot on the Dimension C521 Dell um, PC with a uh, um, Path Pilot and a Tormac supplied MESA on board. I've often wondered what happens if you really highly, highly load a, a stepper system and this test will show some quite amazing results. Okay, so I've zeroed the um, DROs on uh, G55, so now I'll put in um, back to G54. So I can, you can see I've got a dial indicator here contacting um, on the spindle nose, so that tells me a position zeroed there. Um, so now if I traverse away and run a high speed program, now this is just ridiculously fast. It's actually faster than the steppers can manage, um, so it's pushed to the max. The DROs won't be keeping up on the display side anyway. Okay, so let's just run this cycle. So just have a look at how quickly this uh, 3D program is processing. So you'd think at that sort of speed, if it was going to lose steps, it would. Or if the, the software couldn't manage it, or the steppers couldn't manage it, this is where it would show up. You can see the DROs are just basically static. They, they just can't keep up with it. But the distance to go seems to be coping all right. All right, I'll stop that now. And now we'll enter... G55 again. I won't be so rash as to go to zero. We'll just manually go to zero. Okay. Into zero. So this will be reasonably accurate, but not highly accurate. It's only as good as my jogging. Well, look at that. That's within a couple of microns on the DRO, and the dial indicator is showing zero again. So even at those ridiculously high speeds, that's in metric a feed of 8,000, although I don't think it could achieve it. I think it's rapiding at about four or 5,000, so it's probably actually maxing out at about 5,000. Um, but even at that sort of pressure, path pilot and the old series one steppers uh, just not losing position. Um, it's fantastic.